Hey Mike, this is Jeremy with Toriard Digital Marketing. Uh, your associate Jason talked to my associate Ida this morning and we asked if we could send over a video showing you what we do and how we do it to help you get some more customers online. Okay, this is all stuff you can do yourself, uh, but if you need any help with this, uh, feel free to reach out to us. Okay, so let's go ahead and get right into it. Uh, we were specifically looking for HVAC companies and you guys are, are more uh, air duct cleaning is, is your main push, okay? So we're gonna talk about three things in this video. We're gonna talk about content, keywords, and backlinks, okay? Content is basically the amount of text you have on your site. Um, and I've got a few other tidbits I'm gonna talk about too. But um, so, Right here, this right here is your content. You got a little, little bit of a paragraph there, a little bit of a, the, the, not even really a full paragraph. It's like a really long sentence. Um, yeah, it's, that's two sentences, it looks like. So, and then right here, you got a couple of reviews. Um, that's it. You have one section on your site, and your mold reme remediation picture isn't even showing up on your site. This is, this doesn't, it, I don't want to say this the wrong way, but this site looks like, you know, somebody made it in their basement, to be honest. Um, your, your banner right here is all cut off everywhere. Um, so it's not even showing up right, your logo here. Um, and then you, you don't have the pictures. You don't, these don't even go to pages. You should have, you should have pages for all this. Um, and then your email goes to a different website, info at MW Air Solutions, which I, I noticed when I was researching you guys, that, that just redirects to this, Midwest Air Solutions. Uh, not sure why you need those two domain names. Um, but that's, uh, that's you know something we can talk about when we talk. So <clears throat> next thing I looked at, I'm, I'm gonna go ahead and take a look at your on-site SEO. And this also has some keywords on it too. This is uh, uh, SEO Quake. It's a free browser tool, free browser extension for Chrome. Um, and you can kind of get a snapshot of what your on-site SEO is, which is the stuff that's actually on your page. Um, so right here it says you have one backlink uh, total on your site. That's really, really low. Um, you have a total of seven pages, okay? And your main description here, this is what I'm a little concerned about. Because you do work in the Indianapolis area and the word Indianapolis does not even show up here. This is part of the reason why you're not getting found. Uh, it's, it's, it's one of the smaller reasons, but it's, it's part of it. Um, you're not going to get found for the main keywords if you don't have them in the, the meta description. Okay. Um, and then looking at your actual keywords, your density looks pretty good uh, for the most part. So let's go ahead and go to another tool here real quick. This is AREFs. It's a uh, site that, actually, let's go back up to the overview here so we can actually go over this real quick. So uh, this is a site that buys data off of Google and puts it in charts and graphs to make it easier to analyze, okay? So this is showing that you have a total of 55 keywords that are actually ranking somewhere on the site. doesn't mean you're ranking first page or anything like that. It just means they're ranking somewhere. Um, they're, they're ranking a page for those keywords. Uh, and you're getting a total of 12 organic traffic in them, but better than zero. Um, but you can't, you're not going to be able to run a business off of 12, you know, air duct cleanings a month. Okay. Um, you and I both know that. So let's see what keywords you have going here. Okay. So Midwest, that's, um, Midwest ducks volume. Okay. Yeah. This is your branding, and you're not even first page on some of your branding. That's crazy. Okay. Um, so let's see what you are first. Yeah, you got some branding, uh, one one brand, or yeah, one branding phrase here that's your first position in. A lot of the other stuff where your name is actually there, you're not even you're not even on the first page. Okay, that's not good. We like this right here. Um, which one was it? Uh, it's like duct cleaning, duct cleaning Indianapolis. 
That's like the biggest search term in Indianapolis with 90 searches. You get on the first page of that, you're getting those 90 people a month, and then we get you on the first page on, on a lot of the others, you're getting a lot of that traffic, okay? So <clears throat> let's go ahead and take a look at your backlink profile real quick, okay? So your backlinks, you got 12 referring domains and 40 backlinks. However, your DR, which is your domain rating, is at a very, very low 0 0.1, okay? I'm gonna, uh, we're going to dig in and see why that is, okay? First of all, out of those referring domains, only two of them are defaults. So these are these two are the only ones passing power to your page, okay? And you have, the, they're only passing three links to you. So really, you only have three backlinks that are, that are actually uh, giving you any juice at all. Okay, uh, UGC stands for user generated content. That means you blogged and, and, and put your link in somewhere. Um, let's see what this is because you don't want to be spamming people. Um, I'm not going to click on it right now. But um, that's something that we're, we need to look at. Anything that's user-generated content that you usually see, you want to be careful with those um, because those could look to Google like, like a spam link, okay? Like you just comment on somebody's blog and threw in a spam link in there. All right. Um, so let's go ahead and look at the three do-follow links you do have. Yahoo and Fresh Talk. Okay, I'm not really sure what Fresh Chalk is, but they, I mean, they have good uh, domain ratings, but the URL rating for the actual page they're coming from is really low. So um, that's, that's what the UR stands for, is the URL rating. Okay, so let's go ahead and do a quick uh, competitor comparison. So I searched up that top term, duck cleaning Indianapolis, to see who the top people are. So first, first one that comes up is Williams Comfort Air. Okay, they're a national company and they have like location pages and service pages for specific services. Well, that's what we're getting here. We're getting a location service page. Um, so let's go ahead and take a look at their page. As you can see, uh, well, actually, uh, it's, it's not showing you on my screen, but it's WilliamsComfortAir.com forward slash duck dash cleaning. So this is specifically a service uh, page, and as you know, it's got Indianapolis all throughout it. And they've got it, they've got it bolded out. I'm surprised they're not getting in trouble for keyword stuffing for this, because they've got everything all of it bolded for the keywords, and, and it, that looks really, really tacky, even in Google's eyes. So it's probably because of this all down here. This all down here is what's helping them on that, um, and their 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 home page doesn't really have that going on. So having a little bit in there is probably not hurting them as bad as, but um, let's go ahead and take a look at their, uh, pro their overview here. So for just this page, I just searched for URL on ARS. They've only got 19 backlinks and 15 referring domains. None of them are do-follow, by the way. They're not getting any do-follow just to this page. They're kind of piggybacking off this DR right here is what they're doing. That's the DR for the entire, uh, for the entire site of Williams Comfort Air. Um, but they're getting 127 organic traffic to this uh, specific page, okay? So we want that 127 traffic. You know, they, Williams Comfort Air, they, they do everything else um, HVAC related. We want the duct cleaning to come to you, okay? So like I said, these are, these are all things you can do yourself. Uh, remember we talked about backlinks, or I'm sorry, uh, content, keywords, and backlinks. Okay, uh, these are all things you can do yourself. Uh, if you need some help, just uh, email back the, to the email that we sent this video on, or you can give us a call at 317-961-3757. Have a great day.